A Metro mother is arrested, accused of attempting to leave her two children alone at a gas station in Oklahoma City. Thanks for joining us. I'm Carl Torp. And I'm Amanda Taylor. Police tracked her down in a car with her children following a desperate call to 911. News 9 Sylvia Corkill is here now with the details. Sylvia. Amanda Carl, the caller reported seeing a visibly intoxicated woman later identified as Amber Adams drive off with her children after her alleged attempts to abandon them were thwarted. Police said the call to 911 was made from this gas station parking lot where witness claimed Amber Adams exited her car and from the passenger side grabbed a baby from the arm as if he was a rag doll. Was concerned about the welfare or well-being of the children. Caller said Adams tossed the baby to the ground and then attempted to retrieve another child from her car when her passenger intervened. After driving away with her children, police tracked down her vehicle, stopping her in a Deer Creek neighborhood. Ran back in the bedroom and was like, cops are surrounding our house. Brooklyn Childers was at home with her boyfriend. And we ran to our first bedroom window and saw probably about 10 police cars. There was one car clearly being searched. Adams was arrested. Another one had a woman in it that was kicking and screaming at the doors. When confronted by police, court filings show Adams told officers she planned to leave her children at the gas station so she could have sex and intended to send their father a pin locator so he could find them. So that they could come and pick up the children. Police say Adams was so intoxicated she began to hallucinate and claimed her third child had jumped out of the car, triggering a search. From that point on, I mean, flashlights were coming out and about probably 12 cop cars were out. I mean, searching the neighborhood about five in the morning. The child was eventually found safe with a family member. Now, Adams has yet to be formally charged. She was released from jail this morning pending further investigation. Reports show she is currently on probation in Florida for an unrelated case of child neglect. Sylvia Corkill, Oklahoma Zone, News 9. All right, Sylvia, and following her release this morning, a post on Adams' Facebook page said she planned on selling T-shirts with her mugshot on it for 10 bucks.